Hello, this is Bobby with Iconic Autos in Scottsdale, Arizona. And here we have for you, I'm doing a short little video on this 1977 Oldsmobile Tornado Brome. Uh, this car came out of an estate uh, that we recently acquired as after actually a couple of Cadillacs in the state and I ended up with this car too. Uh, it's got 17,000 actual miles on it. Um, just to, I believe it came from the original uh, family. The original is an elderly couple that owned it that passed away. And uh, the family believes that they've owned it. And they owned it for years. They believe they're possibly the original owners on the car. Um, it's a neat car. Uh, it, uh, I'd like to describe it. It was a 17,000 mile car. It's definitely a 17,000 mile car. It's been painted once, with all original interior in it, all original chrome and everything. It was well kept, but it's not perfect. Let's just say that. Um, it's just a, it's a low mileage car, but it's not a perfect low mileage car. If it was a perfect low mileage car, I'd be asking 20 some thousand for it. Uh, I'm only asking 9900 for the car. I think it's bargain priced. Uh, I just, it, it's not absolutely pristine like I like cars, but it's a really clean, like you can't, what do you buy for under 10 grand with 17,000 miles? Um, like I say, the car is probably painted 15, 20 years ago. They did a pretty nice paint job. There's no overspray, everything is masked off. Uh, original chrome. I think the car probably just sat outside for a few years. That's what I think. It just wasn't in great storage. But, but yet it's still a nice car. So that's why I'm going over it. I'm um, showing the condition. You can see the chrome is not perfect. It's showing its age a little bit. If someone just wants a cruiser for cheap money, this looks, looks great from five, 10 feet away. You get up close, it still looks nice. Just again, little stuff like this, like the chrome's not pristine. This is this, the rubber, uh, the rubber fillers actually are still really nice on the car. Um, the chrome is actually overall pretty nice. Uh, paint job is actually a pretty nice paint job, but uh, you know, um, a few little flaws in the paint, like a little spot there, uh, a little mark there. I mean, I'm being super picky. I am a picky person. I uh, like the chrome is a little pitted on the door handle. Uh, the top was re-dyed. Um, it's a little shrunk up here. It's got a couple of boo-boo imperfections there and there. Again, looking back, you don't notice it. Uh, a little bit of clear peeling there and here. And some people think I'm nuts picking it apart like this, but I just want everyone to be totally aware. All this just stainless is really nice on the bottom. I'm probably cheap selling the car, but it's not my... I wanted the Cadillac, so this is... I just ended up with this car. Um, all the glass is beautiful. Fit and finish is really good. All the rear panels. It rubs the hair right here. I think did this probably uh, when they repainted it. They, I don't know what they did there, but all the fillers back here are nice. Original, original fuel thing there. You can see how nice the, the, the door is for the license plate holder. All the lights work. Again, on the chrome, you can see the chrome is showing its age a little bit. The filler, the, these back, these uh, bumper guards, paint colors, discoloring a hair on it. Got a little chip there. There's touch of paint in the trunk. A little mark there, probably buff out. Again, a few little mark imperfections on the uh, the top here, but overall nice. All the weather stripping is really nice and pliable on the car. Um, little pitting there. You got a little mark right here. A few little marks here. I mean, some of that stuff, I didn't even buff the car. You got a little pitting there. All the glass is nice on it. All the trim's really nice. Uh, doors closed nice. It's got newer tires on it. Uh, nice hubcaps. All the the uh, wheel opening loans are super nice. Radio works, power antenna works. It's a factory air car, it's a loaded up car. Uh, the AC does not, it, it's all there. It probably might just need a charge. All the interior lights work. Oh, let's go to the interior. <laughs> um, you can see 
I mean, this is definitely a original model car. You can see how nice the interior is. And again, when I say it sits outside, it's got a little crack, hairline crack on the dash. But look how nice this dash panel is. It's nice and bright and the cluster. Look how clean and bright that is. Now, even the steering wheel is nice. No cracks. The inlay is coming up a little bit. That's common. Cruise control. It's got the original mats. Nice underneath there. Uh, door panel is nice. This the armrest cracked a little bit. The other one's perfect. All the power windows work. The power locks work. Again, all nice weather stripping. Uh, original carpet's beautiful. You can see that's not a high model carpet. Uh, seats work except for the, the back and forth on this driver's seat, but all the other the other seat does work. Let's see how nice the back seats are. This car even has like a new car smell to it. See the ashtrays are super clean and nice. Pop the hood. Uh, trunk, electric trunk popper works great. plates are again the carpet super clean oh, this works the interior lights work in here uh, this this door panel is beautiful I guess I'm doing a dusk video here because I'm losing light but you can see under the hood it's just nice and original. See, everything's intact. You got tons of pictures too. You know. Here's a hood pad. All the lights work. Let's take it for a spin. Starts right up. It needs a muffler. The muffler's got a little hole in it. The mufflers get condensation, you know. Um, the power antenna works, as you can see. Oh, get the radio works. Um, our windows all work. Power locks work, uh, directionals work, lights work, gas gauge works because you put gas in it, the speedo works, wipers work. AC when you turn it on, the fans work, the blower works. So I think it just needs to be charged, honestly. I could have done a way better job cleaning that window, but uh, you get the point. <laughs> uh, literally, all we did is wash the car. It, so you get it as we got it. Um, mechanically, they before they sold it, they rebuilt the car, cleaned the tank out, um, two, did a full tune-up, uh, brakes work good. I mean, it really is a nice running driving car. You can tell it's a low-mile car for sure. And also, the mirror is in the glove box. It just got to, like, literally pep boys. You get the glue and put the glue, glue the little thing on there, and you put the mirror on there. Right there, and these are all the receipts to all the stuff that mechanically is done to it. But overall, nice car, nice solid car. Um, again, what do you buy for this kind of money? 
nothing. <laughs> so you're more than welcome to send someone to look at it. Come look at it yourself. Uh, be confident. We'll ship it anywhere in the country or even the world for you. So uh, any questions, again, call me, email me, message me. I'll be happy to answer them. Thank you very much and have a great night or day. <laughs> Whatever you're looking at this. All right, bye.